The Ramakrishna Mission Institute of Culture, a branch of the Ramakrishna Mission, was founded in 1938. Its aim was to promote the divinity of man and spiritual unity underlying cultural, religious and socio-economic diversity. The Institute fosters the founding of human relationships on the basis of the divinity of man and spiritual oneness, as enunciated in the Vedanta and expressed in the lives, spiritual experiences and teachings of Sri Ramakrishna, Sri Sarada Devi and Swami Vivekananda. The Institute initially functioned from various locations in Kolkata before finding its permanent anchor in this majestic edifice, a landmark and a heritage building in Gold Park, South Kolkata. The building was inaugurated by Prime Minister Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru in 1961. While Swami Nitya Swarupananda Ji Maharaj was the founder secretary, venerable monks Swami Ranganathananda Ji Maharaj, former president of the Ramakrishna Martin Mission, Swami Akuntananda Ji Maharaj, Swami Lokeshwarananda Ji Maharaj, Swami Prabhananda Ji Maharaj, the present vice president of the Ramakrishna Martin Mission, and Swami Sarva Bhutananda Ji Maharaj have adorned the seat of the secretary of the Ramakrishna Mission Institute of Culture. At present, Swami Suparnananda Ji Maharaj is at the hem of affairs of this institute as its secretary. Books suggest the inner light and the method of bringing that out, said Swamiji. The library is one of the busiest departments with an average daily attendance of 2,000 readers. The well-illuminated spacious reading room. The computerized environment ideally suits the present digital age. The library has three wings, general, children, and junior. It has a stock of more than 260,000 books. Rare collection section. Strong room. Periodical section. Book processing section. E-book, journals and circulation. In short, the library has been playing a pivotal role to digitize, store, organize and disseminate its knowledge and culture base as contained in books and other documents by putting into use information communication technology. The Bulletin Department. The Museum and Art Gallery represents India's pluralistic culture through its rich collection. It has four major divisions, paintings, sculptures, folk arts, and MSS. The Sarada Devi School of Fine Arts and Crafts for children between the ages of 7 and 12. The Vivekananda Hall, a world-class auditorium. The Center for Indological Studies and Research cultivates the study and research of Indology, science, 
Sanskrit, philosophy, Indian scriptures and culture among Indian and foreign scholars. It is recognized as a seat of high learning and research by the universities of Calcutta, Jadavpur, among other universities, and also by the Indian Council of Social Science Research, Indian Council of Philosophical Research, and similar bodies. It offers facilities for doctoral, postdoctoral, and other research projects, postgraduate diploma and certificate courses. It also organizes national, international seminars and short-term workshops. The Institute's value orientation programs include convening regular sessions of its two youth wings, organizing conferences for youth and teachers in rural areas. Conducting value education conferences for youth. The School of Languages facilitates intercultural understanding by eradicating the barrier of language. It is one of the largest of its kind in the country, teaching 17 different languages, 12 foreign and 5 Indian. The institute has a universal meditation room that caters to all, irrespective of their religious beliefs and concepts of God. The chapel, dedicated to Sri Ramakrishna, Sri Sarada Devi and Swami Vivekananda. Yeah.